Well, good morning and welcome. My name's Anthony Nielsen. I'm one of the owners here at uh, Sol Hughes Property Agents in uh, Porto de Mazon, Costa Calida. And today we have a live video tour of an exclusive luxury property in Lothoya, in the region of Cartagena. So I'm going to turn the camera to show you the, the property because I'm sure you don't want to see my face. Um, and we'll start the tour. So here we have a property set in an exclusive area of Lothoya. Like I said, it's in the region of Cartagena. This property has been uh, recently renovated to a really high standard and a good quality. And it's set on a large plot. It's in a quiet street. We're a second row to the beach, Blue Flag Beach of Lothoya. So I'm going to walk you through. Anyone with any questions, feel free to uh, ask as we're touring and I'll try and answer those as we go. So the property's recently been on the market for 800,000 and just the owners have recently just reduced it to 700,000, which is why we're doing a video tour to give you a bit more of an insight into how um, good this property is and, and the quality of it. So we've got a terraced, fully terraced area leading to a grand entrance door. Through the entrance door, you're welcomed by a very large um, lounge reception area. The property benefits from um, integrated air conditioning and heating as you'll see in the vents at high level there. All windows on the ground floor are aluminium double glazed, complete with wreckers, fly screens and shutters. The property comprises of a high security system with a video entrance security door system also. Again, as you'll see, hopefully good quality and well, um, good, good standard of uh, finish throughout. So we're going from this area into the kitchen. So we've got double doors leading into the kitchen, very modern kitchen. Light and airy, all integrated appliances with American style stainless steel fridge freezer. Double oven, Bosch, Hogan extractor. Glass curtains with a view of the pool, which we'll be able to see a bit later. Feature gas fireplace. Door out to the uh, terrace from the dining area, large dining seating area. And from here, we go into a downstairs study. Very light and airy, very spacious room. Complete with Wi-Fi. The downstairs toilet, towel rail, white goods, fully tiled. So just to get a good view there. Of the size. Okay, so we're now going to take you upstairs. Here we have a. This is on the side of the property, so we've got this uh, curved, well lit, light stairwell leading to four bedrooms on the first floor. I'll take you into bedroom one. All the bedrooms are really good sizes, so this is the uh, bedroom one. 
double bedroom. Has its own terrace with a view of the mountains and the garden. Space for a little table and chairs. View of the mountains. So you've got two large sets of double doors, patio doors here, and you've got like a communal terrace here, larger space, which leads up to the solarium, which you'll go up to shortly. Magnificent views. Like I said earlier, the property has been done to a really good high standard. Um, it's, it's, it's as new, basically. So here, the hallway leads to bedroom two. Again, another large double bedroom. Integrated wardrobes. And again, it's in a little terrace here. With a view out to the front. I can show you just, you can just see there through the trees, the sea, it's a bit hazy today, but uh, you can make out the sea is just past those trees in front of us. As I said, it's very quiet, the area itself. It's uh, a prime location. So this is bedroom number two. And there is also a bathroom here, a shower room, should I say, fully fitted shower room for those bedrooms. That leads to bedroom three. Again, integrated wardrobes. This one has an ensuite and a balcony. Fully fitted walk-in shower. And again, its own terrace. This has a wraparound terrace. Slight. Shaded, actually really nice because we're facing the south, so later on that'll be Warmer, so you need a little bit of shade. Listen to the birds. You can see the extent actually just from here of the size of the front because everything that's tarmacked or the red stone is owned by the property as well. So, a really good size front area which could have more trees planted or wait for parking or. So, again, this is bedroom three. Double bed, integrated wardrobe space, um, en suite, leading to the main hall, which again leads to that central terrace area, which has the views of the pool and the mountains. Bringing us on to the master suite, super size bedroom, king size, super king size bed. Two sliding patio doors, integrated wardrobe space, and a large ensuite. So this ensuite is slightly different. Has a, a featured bath, shower, toilet, double sink unit, his and hers. Again, very airy and light. And this one also has its own terrace. It 
cup of tea in the morning, watching the sunrise, listening to the birds. This is bedroom four, the master bedroom. So I'm going to take you up to the rooftop solarium now. So we've got a, a metal spiral staircase leading to the roof solarium. This is really where the sun attracts. So here, loads of space, really big, useful space. Plenty of room for sunbathing. We've got two really big storage areas, these domes with the aluminium doors. I'll show you in one. This one to give you a concept of the size. That one has a washer dryer, power, lighting, lockable door, very clean and dry space. Comfortably make that, get a, a fridge in there or something for those uh, really hot days when you're sunbathing up on the roof. Or just good use of storage. And we've got another one. But here we go, we can see up here you get a little bit, now the haze is going slightly, you get a bit of better view of the location. As I say, location, location, location. We've got in the distance there uh, is the, 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 the sea of uh, Lithoya, where we've got the, the, where you can store your boats, small boats. Uh, in the summer, there's lots and lots of boats there, fishing boats and touring boats, jet skis, etc. Um, lots of restaurants nearby, but it's very quiet. There's only um, a couple of shops. Uh, the nearest town, the city of Cartagena, 30 minutes, approximate. Um, and then you've got Mazaran and Isla Plana for some more shops and bars and restaurants as well. Uh, which is like 10, 15 minutes away. So here's a, I'll give you a, a little look from the top before we go down into the garden. So it's a really good size plot. Very unusual to get a size this big in this area. So as I said earlier, if you missed that, it was on. Recently it's been reduced by 100,000. It was 800,000, it's been reduced to 700,000. So there's 100,000 euro saving. Um, and for an extensive property in this area, um, with nothing to be done, you, you could move in, no problem. There's no building work to be done or anything. It's uh, a ready, key ready property. And we're back down to the ground floor and the lounge. So I'll just take you down into the basement of the garage. The drive has a sweeping driveway down to the garage, which we'll have a look at in a minute. So here we have the garage. Again, very clean, fully tiled. Well lit, electric garage door, double garage door. The garage has its own toilet and a, a storeroom. This garage could be used for various, could, you could store your car, you can uh, turn it into a games room, potentially, or a bar. There's lots of uses, or just storage. So, really good space, and like I said, very clean, fully tiled. There you go. 
So we now go back up to the ground floor. I think I may have just lost you a little bit there when I was in the basement with the signal. So we're now going to, um, I'm going to come out the back garden and take you into the pool area. So this is the dining room, leads out to this magnificent, large, fully tiled and landscaped pool area. So we've got really good, strong timber gazebo, which could be your outdoor cozy area, put a TV on the wall. We'll come around to this bit in a minute, but there's another of the side of the house. So we've got all the water features, all the plants and trees are um, irrigate, it has irrigation built in, all set on a timer. You can hear the pump in the background. There's a, a pump house which I've opened up to the pool, tucked out of the way. In fact, there's a view of the back of the property that showing you the vast size of it. So we've got quite a few features in the back garden here. We've got lighting, integrated lighting everywhere. These tiled, grey tiled areas are water features, in fact, with LED lighting on a remote control. This here is a uh, flame um, feature. So you've got a fire feature there. And again, you've got the water features, these grey tiles are water features with LED lighting. Fantastic pool with seating and steps in. So you've got like a, a seating area at the back there with the steps in. Shower room. So we've got this shower, outside shower here with lighting, there's power, plenty of power around. And on the back of this shower, we have, um, the owners have had a, a toilet built in. So you've got a toilet room. And then there's a, a storage cupboard space. see it's a vast space hopefully you get an idea the sheer size really good size plot easy to maintain the current clients of uh, tiled artificial grass and uh, irrigation on the plants so really low maintenance Okay, so I'm going to bring you around to the front. So this here is the uh, the wall of the sweeping driveway. So you've got a double electric gate coming into the property. Outside water tap for washing the car. There's power there, hoovering the car. Concrete paving. And the sweeping driveway leading to the garage. So you've got that where we went into the basement. That's the door there, double garage door. I'll give you some views of the side of the property. Again. Entrance where we came in earlier. Got this lovely rounded feature entrance here that leads into the front door. But these terraces actually as well. Again, ground floor. Some more terrace areas where again, possibly table and chairs just to sit out on those evenings, capture the sun. And then we have this space. Possibly for the kids and a couple of football nets or Various use of space.
and there we go. Okay, so thanks for watching. Um, like I said, my name is Anthony Nielsen. I'm one of the owners of Soul Hughes. Um, if you'd like any more information on this uh, fabulous property, get in touch. Um, you can visit the website, www.soulhughes.com. Um, give us a call. We, if you're in Spain, we can arrange a viewing. Um, if you're not, we can come back, show you the property in more detail if you require, or we can send you pictures, whatever you need. Um, so just get in touch. Hope you've enjoyed that little video, and hopefully speak to you soon. Thank you.